You remember what I said? Don't you? Scania truck driving simulator. Yes, that is right. In addition to Euro Truck Simulator, we got another game from NCS. Um, and I think, uh, basically, I'm a big fan of Scania trucks. And some more. Scania trucks in this game is even more realistic than in Euro Truck Simulator 2. Even though this is only based on SCS 1.5 generation engine. So that's very cool. But I'm trying to think what are we going to do today? Um Maybe we'll do some time reaction first. How about that? Sounds good to me. So basically you are meant to break as soon as you see a thing in front like that. And what's that frame rate about? Um wait. That is ridiculous. Hold on. Uh, that goes back down to 100% even. I don't even know. I do want to switch the resolution. Bam. I'm going to keep this game as um, 60 FPS, not Euro Truck. Because it's basically. Even though Scania trucks looks alright, but the scenarios around there isn't as good as it is in the other game. So, but the the truck in this game is real realistic sounding, just like Scania. If you ever been on a Scania bus, you will know this sound. Anyway, uh, let's go get started. Ah, uh, hear that. But we're going at least 50 kilometers per hour. And we're meant to break as soon as we see some obstructions appearing. That's rubbish. Okay. Um. Okay, I'm just going to go at. 51 cruise control. Ah, oh, that's pretty quick. Is it 44 milliseconds? I don't think it's that short, isn't it? Wow, lag spikes. This game does give you an idea of how Euro Truck Simulator 1 used to look like. Okay, that time is a little bit more. By the way, this game has a, uh, I mean this function in this game has a very good use. When somebody has been drinking and they say they're not drunk, Get them to this test, and they'll be doing much, much worse. Try that in your friend, if you have this guy. Try it. <laughs> ah. I really think I can do it a little bit better. Oh, it's a brand new truck, I've only been driving on it for one kilometer. That's what it has on its clock. That's cool. Okay, that time is 69. Cool. So what are we doing now? Wow. Okay, nine time then. Can I even... Are you serious? That is totally worry duck.
I can't see anything at all. Okay, I'm just driving on this thing like a, it's on a you know, track. And I'm going to put my finger on an accelerator. So it'll be a little bit more realistic. What happened there? That was like on lag spike. Okay, that time is pretty good. It's probably really dark on the videos though. Ooh. Well, that's not very good. for it. Ah, oh, that's rubbish. I always quick control for now. I think when you are driving a real car, put a car in cruise control and put your foot on brake can give you much better reaction time. And reduce the amount of accident could happen. Maybe not. Okay. That's all the reaction tests we're going to do today. That too. Let's see what's the number three. Okay, that, that's always a trailer. Uh, final test. Anyway. Let's, let's try something else. Maybe we'll take a look today at the Scania Demo Center. So I believe this city is called Suggestic. Uh, it's close to the capital of Sweden, uh, Stockholm. I've been in this place before. Um, yeah. This is pretty cool. It doesn't look like anything on this game though. My road outside is pretty similar I think. Feel that feel that suspension system though. I'm feeling like that's in all way better than Euro Truck Simulator 2. And hear the engine. But we're just going to go out and do a spin here. No, that's like wrong way. By the way, there's no damage to truck in this game, unlike in Euro Truck. Uh, I think we we'll missed the exit. Oh, there's a bonus point. Can I pick it up at all? Hello? Not really, I don't think so. Okay. Um... So... Where the hell is the exit?
And this is one of the most realis realistic look structure of Swedish road ever in the in, in you know any product my best yes. Okay. We're just going to take this uh, trailer because it can help us to hear the real sound of the engine. Nope, wrong gear. Once again, if you've been on a Scania bus before, you will, you will hear some fami fam familiar, no, familiar sound. Sound? I don't know what's wrong with my English today, but just here. By the way, this is actually the test route by Scania in the demo center. So you can, well, if you want to buy one, you can test drive a bus, a truck, or something else by Scania on this road. And I'm seeing a real realistic uh, distance and fuel consumption. I hope you should do the same. And I think this demo center is built on a one, one, one to one basis. I do believe. We have truck speed limit to 90 though. Going to try to enter this curve at full speed. Yeah, I'm doing just fine. But you see how the trailer wobbles when you turn too quickly. That's what happened in real life, but that's not what happened in Euro Truck Simulator 2. So I don't know what's happening with that, and we're just here, I don't know. Anyway, um... We're going to go in and park this trailer now. Oops! Accident! You lost the ability to turn when the trailer is dragging you somewhere else. That's exactly like real life. And that's how I like it. And every year Scania has driver's competition and young driver's competition. It is always held in... Uh, and it's always going to be held in this place, I really do believe. This is one of the coolest place on earth. For me anyway. Okay, we're going into the parking lot again. I don't have my uh, indicator kit set up. So, no indicator for now, but there's not, not, none traffic moving around in this area, so whatever.
Any pedestrians? No. I hear the sound when the when the gears goes down. That's exactly how Scania sounds like. And it should be. Anyway, we're going into there, parking lot over there. That's a rubbish reverse. Let's do that again. Oh, by the way, I mentioned, uh, Truck drivers uh, competition. It is actually in this game. I will do plenty of that in the future. So don't you worry. Okay, 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 okay. I'm happy with that. What am I doing? I'm not sure whether the physics is realistic in this game, but I should should be able to drift if it is realistic. Otherwise, I cannot. Doesn't seem like to. Can I do um burnout if I actually switch the gear to menu? Let me just try that. Um Gearbox sequential. So Seems to like that. Um,
I don't know about this. Well, the handbrake doesn't seem to be doing anything at all. Anyway, that's enough dirt for today. Um, I hope you actually enjoyed this episode of Scania Truck Driving Simulator. Wow, that sounds very broken. But, uh, can, I, can I see the face of the truck? Ah! No, I, I have the setting. Something wrong. Anyway, hope you enjoyed it. And uh, I shall see you next time. Bye bye.